Welcome to the Sneakers Sit Down. I'm your host, Mr. J1 Hype. Take it easy. Enjoy the show. Enjoy your day. So we have a fantastic video for you. Now, first off, if you're new to this channel and the Sneakers Sit Down, go ahead, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you can get each and every new video from the Sneaker Sit Down. So, yes, I finally got them, guys. I have, yes, the Jordan. Four wet cements, aka Paris Olympics uh, special edition Jordan 4. But this is a fantastic sneaker, guys. Just look at it. How amazing are these? So, listen, guys, this shoe was inspired by the cobblestone streets of Paris. And for this year's Olympics 2024, we have the Olympics in Paris. So this is a tribute to the, the streets of Paris. Amazing guys. I think they did an amazing job trying to give us a unique shoe and you know design that will inspire us to watch the Olympics and inspire us to see the beauty of Paris. So they used a combination of suede and nubuck throughout the entire shoe in this, um, what was the colors again? Oh yeah, they were smoke gray and iron gray, which they dub wet cement, um, like, you know, the streets of uh, Paris, cobblestone, cement. I, I see what, what they're going with. And man, listen, as you look at this iconic shoe, the Jordan 4, which we know so well, the Jordan 4 is one of the most popular Jordans of all time. It is an iconic shoe that will stand the test of time. And just the beauty and the great um, design that Tinker Hatfield did for his second iteration for Jordan. Uh, Michael Jordan and his signature shoe and Nike at the time he made a masterpiece so with this version of the Jordan 4 we do not have the netting but we do have a you know like quilted um, area right here in the shoe that gives us like a unique uh, touch that we're not used to but we have seen before in other releases you have this nice new buck tongue that's totally unique to this shoe because Jordan brand usually does not use a tongue like this for the Jordan 4 and you know this type of style which is really dope um, you have this back tab um, looks like it's like made out of cement or stone which is really dope um, same thing with the wings here that connect um, from each side to the crown lace locks, which you can see also here, the waffle or, cone, or waffle or crown lace locks. You have them all light gray, like cool gray type of uh, laces. And flip the tongue. You have Air Jordan right there that we know so well um, on the bottom of the shoe. Dope guys, love this traction pattern. Um, obviously it is just like the original Jordan 4s. Um, now, what would you rather have the cause, the cool gray 4s or these wet cement 4s? That is a tough choice to, <laughs> you see me almost dropped it, but honestly a tough choice to, um, you know, choose from, but I really love these shoes right here. And continuing on through the midsole here, you have that window to the air unit that the Jordan 4 also has. And the Jordan 3 was the beginning of that design um, type. And then you carried on to the Jordan 4. Tinker had built, carried that from the 3s to the 4s. But overall, the Jordan 4 is a beautiful and classic shoe. And with this cobblestone inspired street 
um, design and colorway. I think it is amazing, guys. And if you're watching the Olympics, if you're into like basketball like I am, I've been watching uh, the Dream Team 2024, and they're doing great. And hopefully they win that gold medal. They should. They have LeBron James, Kevin Durant, Steph Curry, Anthony Edwards, Ant-Man, um, so many other great players. They should be able to win this gold. Bring it home, guys, and bring it home with the Jordan 4 Olympics. Wet cements, and we out. Thank you so much, guys.